My mother always used to say, if someone ever tells you that you're not beautiful, then you must be doing something wrong. She was one smart bitch. She was all about preparation, right? Having all your beauty products on your person at all times. You never know when you'll run into your Prince Charming, she used to say. And God forbid you have some grotesque zit leaking pus all over his Nikes, she used to say. Preparation. The first time I had my period, I was trapped in an elevator with my father and five other strangers for three hours. I was not prepared for that. And that's why I always have my bitches with me. This is my foundation. She coats my face with youth. My blush, who acts as my lawyer, keeping my guilt looking sweet and innocent. And of course my lipstick. Oh, I fucking love my lipstick. It's the blood of my prey, my kill, smeared all over my face, flesh still dangling from my teeth. Ah, and my mascara. Waterproof, of course, in case he wants to come on my face. The dance a woman performs in order to seduce a man is exactly as it occurs in nature. Like birds. The feathers on a female are always brighter and more extravagant than the males in order to catch their eye and impress them. That's how it works, right? Wait, right? Well, whatever. Anyway, I wouldn't have paid Dr. Felix $8,000 to augment my breasts if that wasn't the case. Ah, my decollete. My magnificent décolleté and I are no different than Marie Antoinette or Eleanor Roosevelt or, like, Brittany. Hmm. Sorry for being a lady.